Definitely a first, though, in my opinion. I mean, it's not my opinion. We've never done a set of these before. That we've actually ordered. Sorry. Shout out to uh, Next Level Matt. Is his name Matt? It'd be um, cool if his name was Matt. I feel though. bad if I, but I don't know. I don't remember what his name was. But did you choose the uh, phrase that we did? Is that you? Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I was just asking. Matt, again, you have. You, you sat down over there. Yeah, I'm a big Nicki Minaj fan. Oh, that's what that's what it, I I said it's, that. It's whenever I heard it, yeah. <laughs> but I didn't know if that's what it was. Oh, wow. That's cool. Oh my God. So what does it say? Did it on him. Did it on him. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was uh, similar like to, to a Nicki Minaj song. But... You were right. That's what I So I chose the, uh, I chose this. I like it. They had a bunch That's of good. different ones. I thought that one was best. It's cool. Oh, I'm excited. That makes it feel more real, huh? It does. I'm very excited. You want to see your tires? Have you seen your tires yet? I'd like to see. <laughs> Did it on them. I like it. So the Toyos. You're getting a 40, 50, 50, 26. I thought I could get in there right around. Alex did it one time. He got hurt. Yeah, I'll have a, I'll have a scar on the back of my shoulder forever. So uh, it's actually at the beginning of the Philadelphia video. And just for representation. Uh, and this is for the any level lift right here. It's getting dropped off next week. So within a couple of videos, you guys will see the any level lift up here for about a week straight. We're doing a big brake kit on it and uh, horn blasters kit. But that one will be up here for a while. 40s. Love it. Love it. And uh, what kind of truck do we have the privilege of? building this is a 2022 gmc sierra 2584 then you just pick this up off the lot so how many miles does this thing have on it like a little over a thousand 2022 at4 2500 26 by 16s 40s and a 12 inch cognito all fire engine red all red oh that's it's gonna actually, be crazy i think it's actually cardinal red that's gonna be crazy this color is uh cardinal red that's gonna be nice. It's gonna be a big truck, like a big truck. It's gonna be huge. God, it's gonna be huge. Massive, some might say. I'm excited though. Absolutely. I love that new grill. That's gonna look good. Ooh, that's gonna look good. So we were off, sorry, no. We were open Saturday. I was off Saturday because I was driving to North Carolina that some of you may have seen. But, so I've been off Saturday, Sunday, and then Monday was the fourth. So today is Tuesday. And to be 100% honest with you, after being off for three days, I was really excited to come back to work. We got a big build going on in the shop, which obviously you can see is the thumbnail. We, there's just, there's a lot going on and you know, the. I come to work because, you know, I like what I do and everybody asks me all the time, why do you drive 65 miles one way to work? And one, I love what I do. Two, I get to film YouTube videos. Three, the, the vibes up here are just unmatched. I mean, there's nowhere in the country you can go to get a truck lifted or just a job in general that has vibes. Like, I mean, you see us spraying champagne, at, you know, during during the day and after work and dancing and filming and building trucks and having a good time and just all kinds of stuff up here. And all that's real. Nothing about it is fake. You can't fake anything of what we're doing. But I'm a, I'm a creature of habit. I'm a creature of routine. And part of my routine is getting up, going to Chick-fil-A, coming to work, filming, editing, posting, you know, Instagram, all that stuff. You know, I, I love it. I love it. And when I'm off and when I'm at home, don't, make wrong, don't get me wrong, I like being at home. But it just, you get out of that routine and you know, you just have that area where you're most creative. 
and this seems like it for me is this area you know it seems like being at work and being around these people is is what keeps me the most motivated i love it i love it a lot of times they'll pull the trucks in and get started on them early if they get dropped off early just because we got a lot of stuff going on this week we got two or three of this caliber build going on this week so if we get a truck that gets dropped off early and needs to get in and get started early. So they definitely made a little bit of progress Saturday before everybody left. So from what it looks like, got the cross members in, got all of our differential drop down brackets in, uh, front compression struts um, that we need to uh, flip these on. I don't know if you can tell that. We need to flip the uh, Cognito on them. The, uh, when they got powder coated, I guess they got flipped over. Um, and then we got our uh, torsion drawer portion bar drop brackets in as well so the customer if i remember correctly wanted to go with a color that matched the red of the at4 so we have a uh it's i, I want to say it's a fire truck red is what he told me i want to say it was fire truck red but it's supposed to match the red of the four and the tow hooks obviously on the front and i think we did a pretty good job so we're going obviously white truck all red lift kit, red accents. We've got your uh, your red Cognito upper control arms, spindles, and you got U-bolts, blocks, everything in the back. And then uh, we've got a set of all black 26 by 16 JTX Lotus, 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 with 40 inch Toyos. So this this truck is, uh, this, this is gonna be a monster. 12 inch Cognito, this is gonna be huge. Just finished up the Silverado today. Did some rock lights and wheel lights on it. Or sorry, did the wheel lights today. Rock lights coming soon. Pretty excited. Got the XF off-road with the, with the red on the inside. All red McGoy's kit. Really love it. Love the color. Love the lights. Love the colors. <laughs> the red upper control arms, compression struts on the front. I love the uh, love the red on the inside of the wheels with the red with the red lights too. Big fan, big fan. Sixteens, Chewy. On the Venoms. Oh, oh god. What are we waiting on? We cut. Venom. Are you just gonna open it that way? Ready? No. It looks heavy. This guy drove from Alabama. Got a lift kit done a couple months ago. He's back getting some 26 by 16s and 35s. Working so hard out here, huh? Working so hard. <laughs> well, it's gonna be a good day, I can feel it. Look, the top of the trash can's open. I gotta go, I gotta go over the fence into the top of the trash can, okay? Over the fence into the trash can. I'm not hitting you with nothing. Over the fence, into the trash can. I think, uh, this one's a little heavy though, so I don't know. This one's a little heavy. I gotta make sure it don't rip on me. Oh! That was close, man. Damn it! One of mine on there. Do so you still have the one of mine? I don't think so. But you I'll didn't try. save it. I'll try. So me, me and oh my God. me and Jake have been spending the last 15 minutes turning ourselves into cartoons. You ever like signed up for an app or something that charges you, but you like do what you need to do and then get out of the app before it charges you? So you're essentially playing the system. That's what we're doing right now. But with this is rough. Dude. Show them. No, this, this just show them. Come on. <laughs> oh my God. You look like you're off of Doug Dynasty in that picture. That's rough. I immediately regret that choice. <laughs> you no, no, you look got, like homeboy from Duck Dynasty, 100%. Let me, let me show you yours. 
Yours is funnier. Did it save mine? I don't know. Mine didn't even look like me at all. It was just the. the I think it was that picture, but it made you, my you lips look like really you big. Put the other angle of that same. I'll do the other angle. It made my lips like huge. It's funnier. This one's funnier. Could you do one of my ass? Probably not me, but no. maybe. I got big cheeks. Should I not throw that in there? Should I edit that out? <laughs> it's awkward. <laughs> All right. <laughs> wait, wait, it's, it's covering my face oh. up. Yeah, look, that, that's 100%. That doesn't even, is it focusing? No, it looks like you. Does it really? It does, kind of. <laughs> okay, like a, I can't say it. Screenshot it. <laughs> nope. I get to say when I download that. Oh, really? Yeah, I, yeah, I, did, I didn't download that. Oh, that's rough. I'm gonna no, post that on Instagram. I'm not doing you like that. Run it up. <laughs> Look at that. I'm pretty sure this is the first set of 26 by 16s that we've put on a nine inch lift. We've done 26 by 16s on the nine inch lift with the body lifts before, but we've never done them on a, a nine inch McGoy's. Oh, it was good. With the black accents, the black mirrors. That thing's crazy. 2021 Silverado 1500, all color match silver. Got the black bow tie on the front, black grill. Got the black em emblems on the side. He's debadged the rest of it. There's no decals on the back anymore, which is super nice. Got that really nice, just graphite kind of gray color. 26 by 16, hostile. What were these? Hostile uh, daggers, daggers, right? Yeah. Stickers on the tire, huh? McGoy's up control arms. Absolutely beautiful. McGoy's nine inch lift kit. Even better. 26 by 16 hostile dagger. 35, 15, 50, 26 Venom RTs. That's just a, that's such a beautiful truck. I was a little worried to be honest because I'm not a huge fan of this hostile wheel with the black and milled on it. But the all black, actually I really like it. I think it came together really well on this truck. I'm a really big fan. What are you doing? You don't like the stickers? Not really. No? A lot of people give me problems for it. Some people like them, some people don't. In the comments. I kind of like it better without, to be 100% honest, but I let it ride when I see them. We don't need to prove that we're new anymore. Yeah. So this is, I, I don't know if you remember this build or not. This, this truck, when we built this, was one of those trucks that we had three here at the same day and we came in early and me, Leonard and Brandon were here at like 6.45 or seven o'clock. And this is one of the ones that they did this McGoy's kit in two hours. Really? So we did, obviously we didn't have to do wheels and tires and that's why it came in stock this morning. So we did no lift kit or sorry, no wheels, no tires, no fender modification. All they did was a nine inch lift, throw some spacers on it and put the stock wheels back on it in and out. So that lift kit, Alignment with the spacers out the door two hours. Can I say something? It was in the video too, two hours. A ditto sticker comes off in one piece. Does it really? So even the stickers on the Venoms are cheap. <laughs> I'm just kidding. What was that? I'm just kidding. Ven Venoms aren't cheap. Venoms are a nice tire. I almost threw this in the back of that truck and I don't know whose truck that is. <laughs> it looked like mine, didn't it? Thought it was mine. Oh, it's you would have thrown it in the back of mine, huh? Is that your truck? I don't know what it was. <laughs> I lost it. Is that your truck? <laughs> it's not? What are you driving? You're not driving that. You wouldn't drive that truck. I wouldn't drive that truck. It kind of looks good in the rain, though. Look. <laughs> look. Are you talking about that yeah, one? Yeah. Oh, trash. Get the reels. Behind the scenes, right there. I gotta add that clip into the video like it would be a reel now. Why are you dancing? You usually dance when I put the phone on you. <laughs> Get out of here.
He walks in, doesn't say a word to us, immediately gets on it. Doesn't say a word to us either. He walks in mean mugging, doesn't say a word. Like the black Jesus, look at him. I am Jesus. <laughs> you got a haircut. Bow to me. No days off? Like not even one? Oh shit! I'll be honest, my mood is better now that he's here. No days off? Not even one day off. Oh shit, not the same. You're going a little too swiftly there. Yeah, you, you, you need to you need to slow it down there, Kimo Sabi. Pump the brakes, Turbo. Yeah. That, oh shit. Oh, 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 oh. It's so much harder to get to. He like he like stiffens his back up when he, when he feels you like you get rid of Finn Fowl. You know, I, tried, I tried to go over the bump. Do yeah, don't go over the bump. What's going on, peeps? Yeah. Oh, now you want to say something to us after you come and use us for our? Oh yeah, I'll oh. see y'all later. Yo, your hair is fresh looking today. Huh? That's the new trend right there. We set the trend. We set the trend. 12 inch all red Cognito lift on car tires, baby. What you know about it? What you know about it? 245, 45, 20s. What you, what, what you know about it? No fender modifications. No fender modifications. We, we ain't cut nothing out here. Freaking tucking, tucking 245s. This is the, the weirdest looking thing I've ever seen in my entire life. There is a, a genuine explanation for what's going on here that I'm not going to explain yet because I'm just trying to take in this, this masterpiece here. Yeah, Steve's right there. Turn that thing. I bet that thing don't scrub at all. Jordan, I bet that thing has no scrub, huh? No scrub. Look at that. Full lock, baby. Full lock. <laughs> got it? Full lock, baby. I got it. I think you're good. Don't want to scratch the wheels. Yeah, don't scratch the wheels. You're a little wide. <laughs> That's full lock right there. You didn't even have to take the mud flap off. I love it. It's a new trend right here. Ooh. Don't rip your pants. Getting a little thick back there. Out here cheeked up on a on a Thursday afternoon. Or Wednesday afternoon. Tucking 245s on a 12-inch cognito. All red. Yeah, we should have put spike lug nuts on it. That would have been great. I like the new look. I know that you guys have seen this build on the channel a couple of times, a little couple of sneak peeks or previews on the channel. I've been waiting to finish this one up for a couple of weeks now and I'm just beyond excited and beyond just, uh, just happy, just above and beyond happy with how this truck turned out. And I know that the owner is gonna just be super freaking excited. He's on the way, so he might catch us out here filming. I know that he watches the channel. And before we take a look at the truck, I wanna uh, show some love to the owner of the truck for you know showing love to the channel and supporting us and allowing us to build such a beautiful truck. But it's it's got only, it's only got a couple miles on it. And for us to be able to do something big like this to the brand new trucks is just the coolest freaking thing to me. Sitting in front of me today, we got a 2022 GMC Denali 24, no, sorry, sorry, not Denali, GMC AT4 2500 HD that 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 beautiful beautiful white that we have i love so first of all i don't even really know where to start with this and i'm just i'm just gonna throw everything out there and just y'all pick up as we go okay we got a white 20 white 2500 2022 
AT4 with the red accents, and we wanted to match the red accents. So obviously the only thing that we thought to do, that 12 inch all red Cognito lift kit hurt. Hold on, let me turn the truck off. In previous videos, I know that having the truck on doing this, look at the, oh, we're gonna come back to that. Having the truck on while we're filming has, uh, even though I love that the AC is running inside, filming with the with the truck on, you can that diesel's so loud you can hear it. It overpowers the audio. So, 2500 all red 12 inch Cognito lift kit with the upper control arms. I love the way that Cognito designs their kits. They have the real just small, subtle billet accents on it, especially like on the upper control arms up here. And they come with upper control arm caps. Cognito lift kit comes with the caps, which is super cool. They've got your front compression bars in the front. Come with the Cognito logos on them as well. And then, uh, some, so something that you guys obviously are gonna kind of feel some kind of way, and I do too, Cognito doesn't come with any accent pieces on the cross member, just like FTS does. But the way that they, they design their kit, in my opinion, you don't really need accent pieces. I love the cross design. I'm a big fan. I've always been a big fan. Cognito has been that step up lift kit, in my opinion, because they, they only make the real big sizes. They do have the little, uh, Cognito logo down there on the uh, skid plate, which I'm a big fan of. I just, this like fire truck or candy or whatever kind of red it was, I can't remember. Cognito did a great job on the powder coat. We had it powder coated from Cognito like this. So they do offer that. We did the spindles, all do your drop down brackets, your cross member, your, uh, um, what is it, your sway bar end links, the skid plates, upper control arms. I'm just, I'm a big fan of the red. You guys, and my next truck's gonna have a red lift kit on it. I just, it is what it is. We got your Fox uh, dual resis up front, the 2.0s. Love, I love the design of the, uh, I love, I say duh, I keep saying duh, it's duh. Love the design of the Fox 2.0s, the reservoirs. I have the Fox on the back of mine as well. The uh, front compression struts up here, love it. Like I said, real small accent pieces. And then we did add a couple of accent pieces to the back. You got your, uh, your Fox resis in the back with the U-bolts and blocks as well. Super small touch. Now, obviously, big red lift kit is gonna be something super cool, super nice, but how do you, you know, how do you match up with a, uh, how do you match up with an all red 12 inch Cognito lift kit? Well, you throw some 26 by 16s on it and 40 inch Toyos, that's how. We got your 26 by 16 JTX Lotus with the black spike lug nuts. Gotta have the black spike lug nuts. And then we got your uh, 40, 15, 50, 26 Toyo MT. I love when people throw the Nittos or Toyos on them. It just, it has a different look to it, man. It has a different look. I love it. I absolutely, oh, look, look, look. Look at me, I'm getting ahead of myself. Look at that, look at drop down bracket. Look at that, look at that back there, Cognito. Jeez, jeez, absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, 12 inch red lift, 26 by 16 JTX. Lotus JTX has uh, some of the nicest wheels out right now, obviously up there with American Force and you know some of the others. But that JTX wheel is just, just hitting right now. That Lotus 26, 16, 40, 15, 50, 26 Toyos. Toyos are gonna ride like glass. I'm just letting y'all know. If you want a tire that you don't have to worry about the balance, if you want a tire that you don't want to worry about any kind of vibration or anything out of, get Nitto or Toyo. That's it, That's I'm throwing it out there. Now, all the other ones might shake. I don't care what you say, what you feel about them, Nitto, Toyo, all day long. Get you a set of tires that's not gonna shake. No ifs, ands, buts, or about it. And the last thing, I gotta throw it out, throw it out there. We did do some, uh, we did do some rock lights. We got a uh, eight-piece Infinite Off-Road off rock light. Shout out to uh, shout out to Infinite Off-Road. Love their products right now. Something a little, a little small that we threw in there. Next level mats. Shout out to Next Level Matt. Sent out some mats. Did it on them. I'm pretty sure if you guys see at the beginning of this video that did it on them is uh, shout out to uh, Nicki Minaj. Shout out to Nicki Minaj for the uh, the inspiration for the did it on them. I'm not sure where that came from, but I know that the customer is a fan. So that's obviously where that came from. But I mean, the truck turned out beautifully. 12 inches and 40s, you can't go wrong with it. Love the white and the black with a little bit of red underneath. Underneath, We got the nice red accents to go with it. I just, I'm, I'm a super big fan. Hello, meat. What up? I'm a super big fan with the way that this truck turned out, and I know that uh, I know that Mr. Customer, Mr. Fan of the channel, is going to be super happy. Look, I appreciate you bringing the truck to us. It was a, uh, it's been a journey. I think we both can agree that. But you know, we love you over here. Welcome to the family. As always, let's get this bread. Hey, this bread baby. That's what I'm talking about.